Do you think that's more of a bias or do you think even as like with talk radio or do you think podcasting, like what we're doing right now, yeah. is this? I think this is more valuable than radio. Like as an as an art as an artist that puts out music, mm-hmm. like I, I don't care if radio is not playing my record. I've, okay. I, if somebody were to call me and be like, yo, they playing, you, you, you join on the radio, I'd be like, oh, great. Broadcasting live from the Executive Lab, we present to you an experience like no other. Starring Mr. Come My Way. Come My Way. Remember to put that Mr. in front of my name. Your big brother's big brother. The revolution has begun. So, okay, you said you're in radio, right? Mm-hmm. What, what is your opinion on radio right now? Like, I know you don't want to talk crazy about radio. No, I, I, I don't mind. I, I I think radio is dead. If you ask me, <laughs> if you ask me, I think radio is dead. Okay, you know I mean? dead in the sense to where how we how we used to view it. Like radio is no longer it's not influential anymore. Nah, I don't think radio is influential anymore. I don't think radio, quote unquote, breaks records. Radio radio is not where you go to find new music. Radio is not where you go to listen to your favorite music. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? R- record companies and people that work in radio will tell you it's not dead. But it's not dead from their standpoint because they still use it to run the numbers up, to like mm. to make to fluff the numbers, to make the numbers look good. They'll tell you radio is not dead because it still counts. You can't be number one unless you're on radio. But tell that to radio literally plays like one percent of all the music that's up. Mm-hmm. There's tons of artists that are on tour that you never heard of that are selling out stadiums that don't have a single song on radio. But do you think that's a bias because you're looking at it from the music side. Because there's always the argument where it's like, when I worked in radio, they used to be like, the music is like 5% of the business. They don't care about the music. Right. Do you think that's more of a bias or do you think even as, like with talk radio, or do you think podcasting, like what we're doing right now, yeah. is this... I think this is more valuable than radio. Like, as an as an art, as an an art artist that puts out music, mm-hmm. like I, I don't care if radio's not. Playing my record. I, okay. I, if somebody were to call me and be like, yo, they playing, you, you, you join on the radio, I'd be like, oh, great. I, would, I really wouldn't care, to be honest. But if somebody called me and said, yo, you on this so-and-so playlist, I'd be like, what? So the playlist. <laughs> yeah. Time. I feel like digital is way more effective, way more stronger. I feel like that's where it's at. No, no, mm-hmm. I, artists, artists striving and caring, like striving, working hard to be on the radio is not a thing anymore. Mm. I just don't really care. It's that 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 time of driving in your car and hearing your your ra- song on the radio mm-hmm. and going crazy, that's over. You know I mean, kids, most kids today can't even tell you who's on. Who's radio. on the radio? You know what I mean, they can't tell you who's on from three to seven or six to two, ten or they they can't even tell you because they don't listen to it. But record execs will tell you that it's important. They'll tell you that because it still helps their numbers. It helps them, you know. Maybe when when a Grammy or something helps their argument to you know, you know what I mean that sort of thing. It makes it look good. Oh, the the fastest added record on radio or that it sounds good. You know what I'm saying? So when they're in the record, they're in the business of selling records. So it makes it helps them sell records. And by sell, I mean helps them push it. Mm. You know, so it helps them do that. But to the artist, I don't. Broadcasting live from the Executive Lab, we present to you an experience like no other. Check it out, you know who it is, DJ Scream, checking in with the Executive Lab. It's been a while, man. It's been a long time coming. With exclusive access to some of your favorite personalities, artists, performers, DJs, and so much more. Starring Mr. Come My Way. Come My Way. Remember to put that Mr. in front of my name. Your big brother's big brother. We've got a, a big mission, especially for us as Africans, as black people. Featuring behind the scenes, interviews, yeah, that we're here to stay. on location, live performances from Ama Piano, Afro we're Beats, together to show the world that, you know, there's unity. reggae, hip hop, dancehall. Rock star rolling out. 2024 is going to be lit. The revolution has begun.